Kevin, I haven't even gotten to do my intro yet, and you're already... Where did you get the... Oh my god, okay, I need to pause this. What's up, guys, and welcome to another episode of The Life of Kevin. Now, as you remember last episode, we finished off with uh, Kevin securely tucked in bed, sleeping, gonna have a long day tomorrow meeting more friends, so he had to get his rest, and uh, I just loaded to find him angrily standing out on the side of the road in his underwear, eating cake. I... I have no words. And I was right. Look, Kevin had uh, a six-pack when we started this. And because he ate cake all day yesterday and for breakfast this morning, he's now getting a little chubby. So we might have to go to the gym this episode because uh, Kevin's only going to get worse. And we're going to have to bring, we're going to make something else to bring to neighbors to meet people. We can't make cake anymore. You'll also notice that Kevin doesn't seem to wear shoes or socks for most of his usual wear. But when going to bed, he has... <laughs> <laughs> These delightful little bunny slippers. <laughs> Kevin, I just, I don't even, I don't even know what to say. Okay, we need to figure out what we're going to make to bring to our neighbors. So let's see, we can, um, cook. Oh, none of this looks very, oh, okay. Yeah, let's make mac and cheese. Every those party size mac and cheese. That's a great way to make people. There we go. All right, Kevin's feeling better now. Got him, uh, got him showered up, finished off the night's rest. Now he's going to make some mac and cheese and we'll go visit people. So people have been really excited about this series. I've been really happy. A lot, I know a lot of people actually came to the channel because of the first episode of the series. So, um, and I've had people ask me, you know, when are you going to do the next episode? I saw that, Kevin. Uh, when, when are you going to do the next episode of The Sims 4? And uh, it will be a regular thing. I, I do want to keep up with this series because I think this is one of my favorite games to be playing right now. But I do keep it varied on my channel. So like I do like to play all types of games. As I'm sure you probably noticed, Like uh, I think my last one was Stranded Deep. And then before that was a competitive first-person shooter. And now The Sims 4. So it's all over the place. But rest assured, The Sims will be done. And it will be done every week at least. So... All right, Kevin. No, no, no. Oh, actually, I guess you're hungry. You can have one before we go. That's right. We're going to have a party today. That's that's another thing. So the plan for this episode is we're going to go out and meet as many other neighbors as we can because we only met a few last time. And then um, we'll probably keep it a little faster this time. We'll just uh, hand out invitations, tell people, you know what? I'm new in the neighborhood. We're going to have a party. You should come over. And then by the end of this episode, we'll get the party set up. We'll have everybody over. It's going to be a good time. All right, Kevin. we got lots of neighbors to get to. So let's just introduce... Can we even get in here? Knock on door. Apparently the door is there. Where are you going, Kevin? Kevin, why do you have this weird attitude that it's okay to go in people's backyards? Who's this guy? Probably lives here. Oh, my God. That is that is definitely Snoop Dogg. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so is this just Snoop Dogg's house? Is, does he just live here? Who's this? Oh, he's got a friend who is playing chess by himself. What a master this must be. Of course, only Chuck Norris can play himself in chess. <laughs> okay, Kevin, friendly introduction. Tell him we're having a party, and then we're leaving. They're like beard brothers. He's hanging on your every word, Kevin. <laughs> okay, we can't just sit here talking to Chuck Norris all day. Have we met Snoop? Yes, we've met Snoop. Let's tell let's tell him a joke about ducks. I'm willing to bet he will enjoy it. Come on, Kevin. We're telling Snoop Dogg a joke about ducks. This is this is happening. That is a sentence I said in everyday life. Pando. Okay. <laughs> Kevin, ducks go quack. Chickens go. I don't think. I think Snoop Dogg didn't get it because of that. They were nice. The house smelled a little funny though. I think that might have been Snoop. Who do we have here? This is a fine-looking gentleman. Will Smith, the Fresh Prince. Oh, now I really want to see who lives in this house. Is it like full of actors? I bet. Or maybe it's the whole Fresh Prince family. That'd be great. Okay, you're just just gonna walk away from me after I introduce myself to you. That's that's rude. Knock knock on door, Kevin. Apparently, you can't just knock on door. You have to knock on it here. Kevin, there's a front door right there. Why do you always do this? I, I don't understand. Uh, I don't think we like him. Who else lives here? There's like. Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> okay. Okay. And that is clearly Johnny Depp. 
Don't even yet. Don't even need to ask that. Okay, so this is this wasn't the the um the Fresh Prince house. This is the actor's house by the looks of it. What the hell is that? Okay, this is Shaquille O'Neal. Well, actually, I guess yeah. Te technically, he he is an actor. And Emma Watson. Emma Watson. What happened to you? Oh, what? That is terrifying. Okay, we need to we need to get a, a good look at you. Kevin, come up here. Now, it's been a while since I've seen Emma Watson, but I'm pretty sure she doesn't look like that. <laughs> that is absolutely terrifying. She has, like, no skin. She looks like Mr. Popo from Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, you are Mr. Popo from now on. We're gonna be friends. I guess when she was downloaded, whoever made her used, like, uh, custom content or something from a pack that I don't have, and it's not rendering in, but either way, that is just... Terrifying. She's just giant lips on a like an abyss. Okay, no, Kevin, we don't have a lot of time now. Okay, it's gonna be a friendly introduction. Hi, my name's Kevin. I'm having a party. I might invite you. We don't want to meet Johnny Depp. I heard that guy's a loser. Kind of a jerk. Definitely weird. Where's Shaq? Yeah, let's meet Shaq. I guess you can't adjust to Sim's height in this game. I, I thought in past games you could, but. Kevin is probably not like seven feet tall, and if he is, that's great, but I'm pretty sure... Shaq, you can't just casually talk about llamas to Kevin, it's, it's a sensitive topic. Oh good, he's telling the duck joke again. <laughs> they like it though. You can't tell if they're laughing at the joke or if they're laughing at Kevin for thinking that's the noise a duck makes. Kevin, why are you flirty? You're sitting here talking to three guys, eating mac and cheese, and watching... I... I... I have no words. I don't even know. You're just so flirty. Okay. This was another bust. This was another bust of a house. We have yet to come across a house with a girl that Kevin could get interested in. I mean, technically the X-Men had, like, a couple people, but I don't think Kevin would want to get mixed up with somebody who could, like... Rip his arms off. Barton. Front door. You can do it, buddy. It's right there. <laughs> yeah, you did it. Baby steps. Okay, who lives here? Oh, here we go. This little wiener. What's your name? Bruce Banner. Oh, okay, this is uh, this is probably the Avengers house because we had run into. Who did we run into last episode? Nick Fury, I think it was? Yeah, Nick. We ran into Nick last time. You're inside Bruce Banner, Kevin. That's great, though. He looks just like him. Like, he's all, like, small and unassuming and green. Yeah, Kevin Kevin knows a lot about writing. He, he wrote something once. Flirty introduction with Black Widow? Sure. This is so cool. Who's this? Who's this? It's gotta be Steve Rogers. Yeah, okay. And then the guy with the ponytail was Thor, so they're all here. Kevin, you were, you just can't stand in front of people. There's not a whole lot going on in this house, to be honest. I it was gonna be a little bit cooler than this. Everybody's just kind of hanging out. Probably because I didn't bring Cake. Cake really drives everyone together, you can tell with uh, with the X-Men. There was a big, big difference. Buna, Wibbis. See why. Kevin, you gotta make gotta make eye contact, guy. You can't just look at the fridge and talk to people. Kevin's still having a grand conversation with that coffee pot. Kevin, will you just do what I tell you to do and introduce yourself to Tony Stark? Coffee pot is not gonna come over to our party. He looks really good too with the graphic tee and the little the little goatee. Kevin, you have the coolest friends. This is so cool. And the thing is, I, I can't invite all of them. I think there's a limit to like 20 people you can invite to a party. So that would be like 8 X-Men and 3, 4, 5, 6 Avengers. So I can't have 14 superheroes at my party. I've already met far too many people. So we're going to have to pick and choose who our friends are going to be, Kevin. See if we can make some, some interesting interactions. 
little house, probably a couple people living here. It feels different not having cake with you. Like, I know it's not a big deal, and obviously I can't have Kevin eating, like, cake all day again today, because he'll just balloon up, but there's no, there's no, like, um, there's no conversation starter. There's nobody here. I don't get it. What's going on? Like, is... Jiffa? So Kevin just walked into somebody's home, there's nobody here, sat down and he's now watching TV. Okay, well, you know what, you're tired, let's just sleep here. Why not? Whoever lives here has got to come home eventually to meet us. Hi neighbor, my name's Kevin. You want to pull up a pillow? Have breakfast. You can have uh, scrambled eggs. Who lives here? <laughs> I don't understand. This isn't my house. Kevin is just, he's moved in. He's decided, you know what? If you don't want to meet me, I'm taking your house. What? No, Kevin, Kevin, get in. Kevin, Kevin. <laughs> we burned somebody's house down. Oh my god, okay, Kevin, we're leaving. We're leaving. We're going home, Kevin. So, so. Get out, Kevin. We don't even know who lives here. <laughs> Leave, Kevin. Just go home. We're going home. We're going home. Okay, just just run home. <laughs> Mistakes were made. <laughs> so that just happened. Uh, I... We're gonna have to go see who lived there. I feel really bad. Someone's gonna come home. The food's gonna be eaten. Someone slept in their bed, burned their kitchen to the ground, and then left. Oh, Kevin, you were doing so well. We were making so many friends. Okay, Kevin, Kevin's got money. We will replace everything, okay? Everything will be made right. Oh. Okay, we're back. I felt too guilty. I, I couldn't do it. We have we have to make this right. Kevin, we, we have to at least apologize to whoever lives in here. Hopefully there's somebody home this time. Hello. Oh, we got it all fixed. Hello, Mr. What? <laughs> we burned down Michael Jackson's house. Okay. God, you don't look happy at all. Probably because you came home to your house burned down. Okay, Kevin, just... Like, hi, my name's Kevin. <laughs> we need to talk. Do you want to hear a joke? So I came here, and nobody was here. And then uh, I decided to have breakfast, and I burned the house down. But it wasn't my fault, it was llamas. Llamas did it. I swear, Michael, it was llamas. I think he's buying it. Okay, I think we're cool now. Yeah, well, he's so sad. Oh, uh, but everything's fixed, so I don't think it's a big deal. He must have money in the bank or whatever. We'll be sure to invite him to the party. Maybe. All right, Kevin's gonna have lunch, and let's see if we can start preparing this party. Cause I think everything is all set up. So, plan social event. Let's plan a social event, Kevin. Magic school bus. Producer speaking. All right, so we invited, uh, there was a limit to 15 people, so we had to leave out some people. Michael didn't make the cut, sadly. Um, Justin Bieber, obviously. Kevin, what are you wearing? <laughs> what do you have? That's, that's your party outfit, Kevin. That's... <laughs> You're wearing, you're wearing a Speedo with a, okay, no, this isn't going to do, Kevin. People, you're going to look foolish. I'm sorry. Uh, what about formal? Okay, there we, well, you're still not wearing shoes, but that'll do. I don't know when the, when the party starts. Like, are people. <laughs> Black Widow showed up pissed off and now she's just crumping in my living room. <laughs> He is looking ballin', breaking it down. Wait, who invited Justin? I specifically didn't. Oh no! 
Oh, Look, Smeagol's wearing clothes Sick. and also breaking it down. Oh my god, this is gonna be great. God, this place is bumping. Okay, Kevin, show him how it's done. Show him how it's done, Kevin. What are you doing? It's <laughs> like... Oh, Kevin, you're you're making yourself look embarrassed. You're about as bad as Justin. Mr. Clean is looking dapper. Look at that. He looks like more like Mr. Rogers. <laughs> Man, people are showing up to my party really... Okay, I did not invite this many people. <laughs> Who are all these people? <laughs> Why is Chuck Norris on my computer? <laughs> <laughs> There's something about watching these people dance that just makes me laugh. Like Wolverine. Okay, first of all, Wolverine's hair. <laughs> that's that's an atrocity. But like, I have no words. So we're fighting Justin Bieber before the night's over. That is gonna happen. Kevin just needs to get a few more drinks in him, and then this dance floor is gonna run red with blood. <laughs> Who invited her? Kevin, she's perfect. Go get her. We apparently met her already. Uh, oh God, go, go, get her. That's good. I don't know. Deep conversation. I love that I'm talking about her like she's a Pokemon. Go, Kevin, get her. Use the Master Ball, Kevin. She's worth it. I think we just found a girl for Kevin to get interested into. What's her name? Emma Yager. Yager? Like, like Yarmir Yager's... I could say daughter or wife in reality. Come on, Kevin, put on your best moves. I can't tell if it's going well. What is... Kevin, you are killing this. What does is, what is sexy pose do? Do you think it's too early for a sexy pose? Show your sexy pose, Kevin. <laughs> do you remember tickets to the gun show? Success? Man, oh man, this is absolutely ridiculous. Thanks for coming. No, 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 this can't end. Offer her a rose, Kevin. That's the most romantic thing ever at a bar. Do we have Come on. This can work. I've had a. Oh, there's like, um. Have Sims kiss. Ooh, so there's like accomplishments for parties. Can you kiss her, Kevin? Does the hands count? Hands probably can't, right? People are just walking through her arms. I'm not sure if we should be. That did not count. Okay, Kevin, we got we gotta make a move. There's so much going on. I can't even follow it all. Like I try to usually comment on stuff that's happening and be funny, but right now it's just it is everywhere. Kevin, we need we need a kiss. First kiss. Wow, that was quick. Kevin, you are an absolute genius at this. With, with Bruce just looking on. Yay! Go, Kevin! We got a girlfriend! That, that's totally how it works, right? When you kiss a girl, she's your girlfriend? Okay, she's not laughing at Kevin dancing. I think she's a keeper. House party complete. No, people can't leave. Justin Bieber. Uh, more choices. Me and can we fight you yet? Fight. Go, Kevin. You're confident. Oh my God. No, everybody's saying goodbye. Kevin, stop dancing and go fight Justin Bieber. <laughs> everybody's leaving. My house is a state. <laughs> <laughs> the room clears and the brawl begins. Oh, come on, Kevin, you can do it. You beat him last time. I'm still waiting for all these goodbyes. Is there anybody left? No, literally. Oh, no. Gollum is hanging at my backyard. Yeah, and stay out. Freaking chips on the floor. Who... There's BLTs all over the place, there's chips on the floor, like... Just eat chips, Kevin. Just... It's been a good party, we're just gonna eat chips off the floor. Out on the deck. 
This is a uh, this has been eye opening. I did not think this was possible in The Sims. <laughs> Kevin is pretty much just uh, he spent the evening drinking. He danced with a girl in his house. Uh, first kiss. Beat the crap out of Justin Bieber, and now he's I guess drunk out on his back deck eating chips without any shoes on. <laughs> Kevin, you know you're gonna have to clean this up, right? Like your house is an absolute wreck. Like there's so many people. Somebody started making a cake and just left. <laughs> they just started making a cake and decided, you know what, party's over, we're taking off. Kevin, you got some really crappy neighbors, you know that? So yep, I'm calling this episode a success. Next episode, we'll probably see if we can expand on the uh, the Emma-Kevin romance. I'm, uh, I'm really interested. I don't know how I missed her, like, she must live in the neighborhood next to us, because I only visited people in my neighborhood. But apparently, Kevin already met her. It's like Kevin had done stuff when I logged out last. That's why we found him out on the side of the road. I don't understand. I don't play enough of The Sims. But this was great. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.